This scholarship will cover your full tuition fees and your living expenses for the whole period of your study. But before we get into it, if you are new here, you are welcome to my channel. And if you've not subscribed, please subscribe, like, share and comment and help support my channel. Let's get started. Today we are at the University of Malta and we are going to talk about their Masters by Research Scholarship. This scholarship covers your full tuition fees and gives you a living expenses each month. So if you are looking for a scholarship like this, you should stick around and watch till the end. Before we get to the details, I would like to also say that if you need help with your scholarship or university application, including your CV or Statement of Purpose reviews, feel free to check the link in the description. I offer one-on-one -on -one consultation and if you would like me to look at your application documents or guide you through the application process, just reach out through those links. Now let's get into the details. We are starting with the benefits and it says the scholarship has a duration of one year, so it's a one-year program. The selected candidates will be required to start their studies on a full-time basis in September 2025 and will be receiving a stipend of 500 euros per month for one year. The tuition fee for the first year of studies for local candidates will be covered from the project. Now, this mention of tuition fee is not for international students. This is for local candidates, but we mention international students' tuition later. In case of either extension or suspension of studies, the candidates shall still receive a stipend of 500 per month, provided that the maximum allocated funds to the scholarship from the project are not exceeded and the time frame of the studies is still within the duration of the project. The degree has an annual enrollment fee of 400 euros for local EU EEA applicants and total tuition fees of 13,400 euros for non-EU non-EEA applicants. So this is the amount for international students who are applying to this program. The University of Malta is an equal opportunity employer and seeks to attract top quality students from countries outside the European Union or EEA. Following acceptance to read for MSc on a full-time basis, non-EU EEA applicants may apply for a tuition fee waiver scholarship. If you're able to get an admission, you can apply for a tuition fee waiver, which means that when you get the scholarship, you're going to receive a stipend and then a tuition fee waiver. Following scrutiny of the application, deserving students may enjoy a tuition fee waiver of 40% to 100%. So you have the chance to clear all the 13,400 euros from your fees. The fee waiver will apply for the normal duration of the program being followed. If extension of the period of study are required, these may not necessarily be eligible for a fee waiver. Only applicants who have been accepted unconditionally to read the master of my research on a full-time basis are eligible to apply. Getting a fee waiver is not an automatic right for selected candidates. Now that we know the benefits of the scholarship, let's get into what this scholarship is really about. It says, applications are invited for a master's student to work in collaboration with the Department of Geosciences, Faculty of Science, on the project investigating Malta's recent seismic activity and development of novel tools for earthquake analysis. The students will join the supervisory team, which will be composed of principal investigator Dr. Matthew Agu, who will act as the main supervisor. The MSc students will be involved in updating the Malta earthquake catalog from 2015 to 2024 using data from the Malta Seismic Network. The student will get training in using specialized software such as Syscom P and Isola to locate earthquakes. Before you make the application, you should meet some requirements and it says applicants must satisfy the Master of Science in Geoscience requirements as per UM regulations. Candidates in possession of a BSc in one of the following areas, Geosciences, Physics, Earth Systems, maths statistics are preferred so if you have a bachelor's degree in any of these areas you can apply to the program degrees in other science subjects earth related studies or it will be considered which means it's not just the geoscience system physics if you have a bachelor's degree in any other science subject or earth related program or even it you are going to be considered for the scholarship preference will be given to candidates providing evidence of proficiency in programming students who are currently in their final year of undergraduate program will also be considered subject to successful completion of their program of studies in line with the requirements outlined here. 
The scholarship will be subject to the eligibility of the candidates to meet the entry requirements set out by the University of Malta and the conditions for enrolling in Master's by Research program. So you have to check the entry requirements at this university for this program and make sure you can actually meet them. Some of the requirements are your bachelor's degree and the areas we mentioned. If you are not in any of the areas, you know you can make this application. So you have to meet that requirement. Another requirement is this. International applicants are required to present an internationally recognized English language proficiency certificate at the required level. Further details are available online. International applicants are also advised to familiarize themselves with information available on the website of the International Office, particularly to the sections concerning visas and e-residence permits conditions and requirements. International candidates will need to provide assurance that they have the funds available to cover their stay in Malta. The stipend awarded for this scholarship is to be considered as a form of allowance and will not cover all the costs attached to studying and living in Malta. So you have to also take note of this information. To make the application, candidates should submit their letter of application, a copy of their CV, copies of their certificates and contact details including email address of two referees. Applications may be sent by email to this email address. Applications should be received by non later than Friday, 4th July 2025. So this is the deadline for the scholarship application. International candidates are required to present certified translations of their qualifications into English. That is, if your qualifications are not in English, late applications will not be considered. Then it says note. The scholarship awardee will be required to complete a master's by research application, which is considered separately. So if you're able to get the scholarship, then you are going to be asked to apply for a master of research application at the University of Malta. The selection procedure will involve scrutiny of qualifications and experience claimed, supported by testimonials and slash or certificate shortlisting and an interview and slash or extended interview. Further information may be obtained by contacting Dr. Matthew Agus at this email address. If you want to know more about the program you're applying to, you can come here and click UM Regulations. It's going to take you to the program's page. This is the Master of Science in Geosciences. When you come here, we have the course overview and it says admission requirements. So you can click this and check the requirements they need to make your application. You can go through this and make sure that you meet them before you apply for the scholarship. To apply to this program, you're going to come to apply and it says you can submit your application online. So this is the online portal. Here, you're going to come down and select the first one, which is undergraduate or postgraduate. Here you choose your starting intake, you select October 2025, then you select your first preference course name. So you are going to select the Master of Science in Geosciences. You are going to click this and then you can click apply. If you've been here before, you just log in. If you're a new user, you click new user. Here you can just fill your details, create your account and start making your application. Don't forget to check your requirements and make sure you meet them before you start any of the applications. Please note that you have to apply to the scholarship first. When you are lucky and you are awarded the scholarship, then you are going to be required to apply to the Master of Research program. Good luck to all those who are going to apply and I hope this video has been helpful. If it has, don't forget to like, subscribe, share and comment and help support my channel. See you in the next video. Bye.